council this week to share their concerns over LTNs. East Oxford introduced LTNs in May, and these are areas where motorised traffic is prevented from taking shortcuts through a residential area by using blockades. Well, Linda Elms told Bats TV what she was there protesting, saying that they are now affecting her local business. The low traffic neighbourhoods, basically they're um, bollards that have been put around Oxford, um, stopping vehicles um, from entering and, and using those roads. Before um, the LTNs went in, um, I, I was dead against them, um, and you know, people sort of said to me that were pro, give them a go. Um, I have given them a go, they've been on since March, uh, sorry, May, and um, they're now in July. It's had several impacts on my business, um, one being financial. Uh, it's costing me a lot more on petrol, a lot more in time, and the fact that petrol has gone up um, is another, you know, knock-on effect. I mean, I, I tell you, a journey, I live in Howard Street, I pick a dog up in Morgan Road, to get to that dog, I have to go all the way down to the Cowley Road, to St Clement, round the roundabout, back up the Infy Road. I timed that journey yesterday, it took me 18 minutes, it used to take me three. So, that in itself, the knock-on effect to me is, if that's a member of my team that are doing that, I've got to pay them more money. So it's having a financial impact on, on my business. Um, and also, like you know, I've mentioned before, it's also having an impact um, on the pollution.